July, July 22nd, 1989, on King's Island Day. Here we are pimping into the old parking area. This is exciting. I'm sick of the car. This is wonderful. That is a butt face. There's going to be some great T-bone down here today. I'm that won't come out very good, face. Carol, with the light background. Oh, oh, well. There's the Apple Tower. Hey, ho. David. <laughs> don't don't be filming me into the hole. Oh. I'm not, turd. What's happening? We're driving into the parking lot. Kings Island. Another fun-filled day. And it's only going to cost me about $100. <laughs> Hey, David. Hey, David. Who's that? Oh, Jensen. I'd like to interview you, sir. Where is where is his Uh oh, he's gonna eat it. That's silly. Did you interview him, David? Hey, kids, there's Yogi Bear. There's Yogi Bear. There's David down there with old Fred Redstone. <laughs> Renee and Michelle with the shark. There's the shark, boy. The Jaws won't have much to say, David. Just when you thought the sidewalks were safe. Yep, old Jaws appeared. I'll call you David. Did you see Yogi Bear, kids? Yeah. Where? Did you go over? Yeah. Where is Yogi? Over there. There's Yogi, David. I'm interviewing you. Well, quick, get started. Yogi, as a reminder, shoes, shirts, and shorts must be worn in the park. If you are planning to enjoy our new construction, you can wear them now. But you can wear well, let's go into the park, you guys. Well, we're usually usually one Captain Caveman. Again. Bye! Captain Caveman! Where's Captain Caveman?
Hey, those necklaces are wait, really wait, nice. Wait, you missed the comment. What? Michelle said, look at this. It's tacky but cute. What is it? It's a different color. Tacky huh? but cute. But what is it? It's a banana clip. Right here. <laughs> I like that, though. That's a new nice comment. Nice lid, tacky son. Oh, I hear that. Nice hat. Tacky but cute. Oh, no. I don't know. That's a big bug there. Me too. You haven't bought a necklace like that in a long time, Renee. <laughs> no, but I have that cute. Oh, this is cute. I like this. Oh, how much? $15. Come on, spend that cash. Oh. Did you buy something, David? No, he's admiring. He's admiring. Oh, I no, thought I maybe bought. he bought oh, something. You bought, you bought it? What? Oh, great postcard. Looks good. Come on, you guys. Let's go to another store. David, there's Scooby Doo. Hey, old Scooby-Doo! Hey, Give him Scooby. a Scooby snack! He got Scooby snack! <laughs> Give Scooby a Scooby He's snack! Give him a Scooby snack! I'm gonna interview you! It's a man, it's got cologne on. Got cologne on? That's doggy cologne. That's doggy, doggy cologne. cologne. That could be dog breath. It's a toy dog! Nice lid, little son. Nice lid. Going, squeaks. Eiffel Tower. We're going to go in the uh, David, top That's top. what we're going to climb up. Ugh. I don't know if I can make it. You have to walk up the steps right now. I think I'll walk up the steps too. You know, Carol, it seems to me, I'm not sure, but when I came down there before, I didn't think they had the bars. I thought they only had the railing up to your chest, and that was all. I don't know. That might be up top. I don't know what it is. I don't remember. Up there. Oh my. How do you like the Eiffel Tower, little son? David. Huh? Oh, does the elevator go way up there? All the sir? way to the top. You want to go? Up that platform. Huh? And one more platform. Up hey, there. David, do you want to go all the way up to the top? Up there. I don't think there's any hard next to There's one, two platforms in there. Hey, Dink. Dink, you want to go to the top? It's only 9.30. Where are we now? The Eiffel Tower? Yes, we are. At the 50-foot level. 50-foot level. Looking over the Hanna-Barbera line. Where are we going to? Yeah, it's 5.30. Do you see the, uh, do you see the picnic grounds? Where the rainbow is, that is Kitty Land. That's the yawn of the week for Michelle and the uh, boots. Of course, they got the little beastie over there, which is not a bad roller coaster. Not bad. I like it. That's the beastie, isn't it? Yeah. You want to go on the beast today, little boy?
wonder what was stopping that camera from moving around. The sorry sound mic was hitting the uh, hitting the bars. Um, What'd you say? The Ohio State law what? What's you? Drop cross off. Cross that forbids. Let's you drop. The off. Ohio State law lets you drop objects off of the Eiffel Tower, huh? Yep. I I kind of doubt it. Don't, no, David. No. Don't don't you dare. Don't you dare, little boy. I'd pop your jaw up one side and down the other. I haven't noticed your new jams. Let's check those out, boy. Whoa! What Check are out they? The color. Wet and wild? That's it. They're wet and wild. Kool-Aid style. Kool-Aid cooler. I love those jams. They go perfectly with your hat, son. Oh, Beautiful yeah, color. Cool. Yeah, that looks Close real up. good. There, where's the clock, David? It keeps time, too! Does it really? What's it made out of? Bushes! Huh? There's the vortex. Time. There's the vortex and the beast. Bye, honey. Bye, honey. I'll see you later. Come here. The vortex is stopped right on the hill. Bye. Be careful. Where's the vortex stop? Is that right? Go on, David. Go on down the steps, you old turf. Hey, David, I thought you were afraid of heights. Where are we heading, Carol? Picnic ground. All right. What do I have to carry? No the oh good, nothing. Cool. That's the way I like it. Star, right? Come on, Step David, let's roll. Let's go on the glass floor right now. Yeah. Well, obviously the glass He's not in yet. But he'll be here. I just don't know. Yeah, we might as well go to the state fair when we get back from uh, Myrtle Beach. Get it. That's boring. You gonna buy something? I don't know. I'm looking for, I'm, I want to get something for Amanda and Martina. Oh, okay. Do you find something for the girls' kids? No. No? Well, this is the last I'll see you for about three hours. Bye. Bye. What's he doing? Well, come on, let's go on back over to the uh, gates now. Yeah. After we get done with this, we'll ride the beastie and then go we'll put our food away. <laughs> that is, if the beastie's running, and well, it looks like it's running, but there's nobody in it. Look at that! What is that? That's uh, Zelda the Witch or Wanda the Witch or something like that. And now here we go into the ride, David. Woo! Who is that? Papa Smurf? No, that's Murfat. She's playing a kite. That's probably Lazy Smurf. Playing volleyball with the spider's whip. Yep, the spider's the referee. They have themselves a picnic. This is like Halloween. Right. There's Gargamel, by golly. How do you like this ride, David? David, how do you like this ride? You can talk about it. Do you like it or do you love it? Yeah, that's kind of 
Last time you'll ever what, be What do you here. think, David? Yeah, How'd you like exactly this ride, huh? Was it worth it? Huh? Yeah. What do you think, David? Can you handle that hill? Yeah. You think you can handle it, little guy? No I think this will be jammed with people later on today. this place. Hi, Daddy. Hi, son. This is a pretty good ride through all the trees and everything. Let me know. Whoa. Whoa, this is a rough ride. Yeah. I got to do everything I can to hold this camera steady. Me, little son, why do birds drop a load everywhere they go? Well, because when mom's here, she scares the wee lead out of them. Here we are back at the old picnic area, away from everybody right now, having ourselves a little snack, and we're going to go on the beast, and then we're heading for the water, the water slide. We need that water, it's getting hot. This is awful pretty back in through here though. A lot of nice woods. Then we got a lake out there. Done a complete swing around. What do you say, Mr. Skin? Let's head for the beast. And then the water. Huh? What do you say, Carol? Good. We'd like that. Boy, it's nice and quiet back here right now. It sure is good to be away from the pus. When the pus shows, GL goes. Right, son? And when the pus goes, GL shows. Right, son? He says, don't bug me, Dad. I'm down in my swell. Ah. I can hear those coasters going left and right behind us. Look. You know, that's one thing I do like about Kings Island. They've got a m more woods than uh, than Cedar Point. You know it, Carol? Right. I think so. Then you will come back? Yeah, I'll come back, son. I was just mad there for a second. Whew. Does that make you happy? I thought we were never going to come again. Yeah, we'll come again. Let's go ride the beast now. Come on, let's go. We're wasting he time. a sandwich. He's getting a sandwich. Okay. Now, as you can see, David's going to have the old standby, a little PB and J to tide him over till lunchtime. That's because the Turk wouldn't eat any breakfast. We'll invite him to have pie and ice cream for breakfast. If he had pie and ice cream for breakfast, he wouldn't eat, so now he's going to have PB and J. He's got to have a sugar fix. Have it. Okay, oh, come on. He can take that with him. We can walk. Let's go no, to the beach. I can't walk with this and. Come on, David, you're slowing us down now, son. Gary. Not a bad little stream running through this place here. Got ourselves a nice little bridge. And then the stream runs right out to the lake. It's kind of pretty back in through here, to be honest with you. And here they come. Meat of Smoke and Mr. Bone. Mr. Skin. Come on, you guys, let's roll! Time's a wasting! Where are you going, little boy? The waterworks? Waterworks! Thanks. 
And there goes David heading to the waterworks. That boy needs some water slides. He needs a wet and wild. Yeah, so do I. They're still trying to make it to the waterworks. Well, you're not there either. Nope. David is hot and tired. He says, let's move out. The camera to his face, that's daddy. They're making it up the steps. It looks like we're going to get to the waterworks sometime today. We will hit the water. Right, Squeaks? Squeaks says, you bet, Dad. Here we go, heading over to the waterworks. This is a longer walk than that girl said. Well, here we are. We finally made it to the waterworks. Okay, do you Let's want to find the lockers and get in there? To the right of the lockers. Are we going to take any more pictures? Not right now. We're going to lock the camera up in the. Uh, okay. I've seen enough of the waterworks on film. Now I want to feel it. <laughs> Where's something like Witch's Wheel, David? It's, it just took off right now. There's something like Ocean Oak Motion. Here we are. Where are we? At the top of the Eiffel Tower, right? Yep. There's a uh, King Cobra, I think, down there, yeah. There's the uh, There's the roller coaster that goes backwards, I think. Yeah, it's right over there. Right Does that go there. backwards? Yeah, that's what I thought. It goes forwards and backwards. Forwards and backwards, right. And the monorail is over there. Yeah, that goes backwards. Monorail just Monorail way back there, David. That's where all the animals are in the zoo. Back here in that woods. There's, oh, it's a monorail. It doesn't go up in the air. It's just on a track on the ground. In fact, I can see the train back there now. And right beside it is a um, uh, bicycle. And the reel. Dan, do you want me to go on King Cobra? Look at that, David. I've all, I can almost get through the rail, huh? That's the racing. Oh, oh, the red track. The red track. David? David, see it there? You can see the vortex. White water. White water. Down there was the David, what do you see? David? Hey, little guy, what can you see? You see a lot, huh? Dad. Well, today is Sunday. Whee! No, no, who did that? Me, it's from a song no. from church. Today is Sunday, July 23rd, 1989, and here we are taking Renee to camp. Now, this is the road, Renee. I don't need any background music. I don't need background music, kids. This is the road that takes us right into Camp Echo. David? This is the road that takes us into Camp Echo. This doesn't look any different than it did 35, 30 years ago when I first came down was here as a kid. There? That car was there too. Yeah, no, honey, that car wasn't there. I mean, there's the old haunted house back up there. And you better believe it. Can we go exploring there? Well, uh, no, no, that's not part of the campground. Oh, no. Oh my God! Turn this off now, Gary. No, wait a minute. We'll come around here. You, you this road's not any? that long, Carol. I don't know. I I didn't camp here. You did. Okay, you can turn it off now. Well, come on, Renee. Get out. I want to see you out of the car for your first day at camp She's here. Hunting for her thong, Gary. Hunting for her thong. Yes. I'll tell you, it's been a long time since I've been down here. A long time. Right, Daddy, here I come. Where? She's making her grand entrance. It's a little girl. Ta-da, I'm out. That's it. 
Get those, get that. Oh, hey, we had to stop for some good. What are you digging out of there, huh? Huh? Oh my, is that an ugly thing. Dig your things out. Gary, we're working on it. Did they dry? Most. There's the old barn. I'll have to show these pictures to Joe Dunn. He hasn't been down here for a long time, I bet. He probably didn't think I'd make it. You know, when we were coming down here, Carol, those trees didn't exist up there on that hill. They weren't even planted. You know that? What's that? When, when, when Joe and I came down here, none of those trees up there on that hill and that barn type thing, that was all barren. You ready, Boots? Huh? Where'd you get your lid? Big Bry? Yeah. Got that from Dew, huh? Do you have any idea where David is? Yeah. Now he's out running around somewhere, helping himself to what? Do you have my wallet? Yes. Okay, well let's go get her registered. That's not hopscotch, David. That's shuffleboard. That's not hopscotch. See that down there? See that building down there, David? That that used to be the boys' dorm. I don't know if it still is or not. Ryan, please run. We need to talk to him fast. What are you ringing? That's enough. That's enough. What are you ringing the bell for, David? Huh? Let's go down and see the lake, okay? That's good. You'll just get hot and tired doing that. It's fun. I know it. Come on, let's go down and see the lake. Okay. Okay? You gotta drop some wee leaf? Okay, we'll find a spot. David says, Oh, I feel better already. Oh, what happened, little son? You have to drop some wee Mhm. Mm he couldn't wait any longer. That boy had to go. How you feel, son? How's your dinky feel? Does it feel much better? Okay, now let's go down and take a look at the lake, okay? Oh, there's the old check-in. There's the old uh, cafeteria. The main building, I can't remember what they call it. There's the old barn. And there's David heading for the lake. Certainly are fish in that lake. In fact, I just saw one over here. In fact, I saw see a lot of them. In fact, I think men come down here and fish. Men from the churches and stuff like that come down here and fish. In fact, I think they come down here and ice fish. I know they used to when I was a kid. How's the water feel? Great. Is it cold or warm? Perfect. Perfect? I may take my shoes off and wade in there with you in a minute or two, as soon as I, after I get done filming. He's got that camera up to his face 24 hours a day. All the time. I don't go anywhere without that camera. See the little boats that they're going to use? I was a camper here the first year this camp was opened. You know that, David? 30-some years ago, the first year they ever had camp down here, I was one of the campers. Joe Dunn and Gary Simpson. Is it cold? Where it's a little deeper? Sure, it'll be colder. I'll tell you, this place hasn't changed much over the years except for that strip mining. That strip mining's kind of taken away from uh, the way it used to look, but they'll put it back. You see some fish in there, David? Yep. Where? Huh? Are you quick enough to catch them with your hand? I didn't think so. Trying to catch a little boy. Huh? Fish. This water feels pretty good, you know it, David? Mm -hmm. Mom will probably be ticked that we came out and got in the water, but what the heck. Boys gotta be boys, right? Even big boys, huh? Did you catch it? No. Huh? You're kind of slow, right? Here, look at me. Looking in the water? You ready to go back up to the main building? Huh? 
You want to go back up to the main building? We'll have to have Joe Dunn come over and see these shots. I bet it's been a long time since he's been down to camp. David, David, go ahead and holler real loud. Holler your name once and see if you can hear the echo. David! Go ahead, do it again. David! Hear it? Yes! That's the Echo Hill. Go ahead. Boo, boo, boo! Do it again. Hear the echo? You butt face! David, no more of that. Say hi, holler hi. Hi! Hear the echo? Yep. Do it again. Thanks! Hello! See? I told you you could hear Hello. your... Hello! I told you you could hear echoes down here. You didn't believe me, did you, little boy? I believed you. Huh? You believe me? Yeah, I believe you. You want to go back out and I'll show you where that. You going to have campfires this week? Yeah. Is that okay? Oh, up on the hill. Okay, you want to go up and see where they have campfires, David? Or do you want to stay here in the water? In the water! Heck, we can swim when we go home. You know that? We can swim when we go home. Well, little guy, what do you think about the Echo Hill, huh? Is it everything it was cracked up to be? No! Why not? I thought if I just talked like this, it would go... No, you have to holler to get an echo. Oh. You have to holler. You know, it's pretty hot today. It's about 85 or 90 degrees. And that old sun's beating down. Nice day to start camp, huh? Sure is. Well, let's go back up and see if Renee's been enrolled, okay? Let's motor, bud. Let's roll. Now, here David and I are at the Middle Lake, where that infamous scene took place about 25 years ago. Or actually, it's been about 30 years ago, maybe 32. What infamous scene? The infamous scene of GL and, and the Mize, and the Mize, or I don't remember. A few kids got down here and did some damage on a duck when we weren't supposed to. We didn't know, we were just kids. But, what did you do to it? Well, put it this way. That duck is up there now in duck heaven. <laughs> you killed it? Well, we, we damaged it somewhat, and it probably didn't last too long. Actually, GL knows it didn't last at all. <laughs> well, I, I shouldn't have done that, son. I was wrong. I didn't know what I was doing, but that happened here, that happened here at the Middle Lake. And I'll tell you, the middle lake looks just like it did many years ago. Small and tired, with these big bad fellow trees right next to it. And they've gotten a little bigger, but they were pretty, they were about that big when we were down here before. They yeah, make a lot of kindling. We threw damage to the duck. We threw stones and sticks at it, son. We we shouldn't have done it, but like we were kids, didn't know any better. <laughs> What sayeth you, son? Let's roll on down there and see the upper lake. There's another lake here, David. I'll find some sticks and stones and throw them. No, up. David, go on. Walk down the path and we'll go to the upper lake. Yes? Yeah, that path that you found. Right there. That'll take us right up to the upper lake. Pathfinder and Chingnish. Pathfinder and Chingnish cook on the trail one more time. Let's roll on down there, bud. Duck ones in the middle lake. Now, here we are riding to take Renee. To her, to her, uh, what is it? To her cabin, to her dorm. Where's her dorm at, Carol? I believe it's up there. You're right. Oh, really? Okay. We're riding right on up. Well, we're going to put this on pause for a second. Now, here we are riding up to Renee's dorm. This is the girl's dorm. Where is it? Over to your right. It's at the boys' oh. dorm. That cream colored one, Mom. Is that right? That's the cream colored? See no. when... Over to your right, I believe, is the dorm, Gary. Is that... There, there, there. There it is, over there, right past the volleyball net. There's the boys' dorm. Right to the left is the boys' dorm. And there I am. Hi, GL, you coolest of the cool. Ah, yes, here we are. I'm going to shut this sucker off now.
You about ready to, where's Renee, Carol? Where? Come on, Boots, get out and get your stuff. You gotta go into the dorm. Come on. Here she comes, a little girl for her first year at church camp. We found the lower side, Boots. They're waiting for you. Yep, found it. This is the lower side. Go on, honey. There she goes. What'd you give her, Carol? More money? Fun. What were you doing up on that tree, son? Huh? What were you doing? Oh, I did this. No, I got it. No, don't. It looks like you're gonna break that limb down there, son. Okay, I'll get a more supportive limb. I don't know. That's pretty good. But now you better get down, okay? Come on, get down. Hi, hi, hi. hi. <laughs> well, now you'll all be on camera. That's right. Now they're on camera, right? Okay, put your shoes on. We're going, David. Let's go. Come on, time to go. Gotta say goodbye to your system. We're going to roll. Well, Boots, this is it. We'll see you later. We Give Mom a hug. We're going. Bye, honey. Give your little brother a hug. You don't want to give him a hug? You don't have to, Renee. Bye, honey. Now we've dropped Renee off at camp, and we're heading back home, and we're in Carrollton. David saw this park, and he wanted me to stop and let him play. And I said, sure thing, dinkus. No speed, David climbed up there. That won't come out, so I'm going to turn it off. There, that's much better. What are you doing, Dink? What are you on? Uh-oh. Get down. I mean, uh, bend down, David, and use your hands on, on the top and the bottom. On your hands and knees on that thing. That's the way you do it, so you don't fall and get hurt. Plus, tie your shoes. Stop right there and tie your shoes. If you're going to be in this park, you got to tie your shoes, little dinkus. That boy is all skin and bones and breath and earwax. Right, bud? That boy's got some of the hugest lumps of earwax you've ever wanted to see. There, that's more like it, dink. And here he is at the playground moving out to the next thing. What is it going to be? Pole climb. The pole climb. Let climb me see you climb. Let me, come on, let me see you climb that pole, Dink. You should have the strong arm bones to get up there. Uh -huh. A big swimmer like you. Do it. And use your feet, too, to hold yourself up. Now hit it. Go. I can't do it. You can't I got do it? Slippery shoes. Oh, slippery shoes? What's that, up the steps? And then down the slide, right, Dink? I knew it, up the steps and down the slide. Or better yet. Up the slide and down the steps. See, Renee, I told him I'd stop and let him play here, and by golly, I did. Down the steps for the little one, the dinky doodle. There's no other kids at this great park, little son. He says, I'm going to hit it on a Sunday afternoon. This is the way summer should be, right? Is this the way summer day should be, little boy? Talk to me, little nipper. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I think I hear the dude. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What are you climbing up, little son? A giraffe. A giraffe? A giraffe. 
a giraffe. Then what? You get to slide down the pole. Good job, Dink. Well, I'm going to sign off now. As soon as you check out this turtle, I'm going to sign off. To sign off, David's got to do a pose for us. Let me see that one more time, little boy. Look at that kid pose on that turtle's head. That kid is tough. He's tough. Good job, son. Now I'm signing off for the day. At the you park, shine. anyway. Bye. Wait, I couldn't shine off, sign off without getting a shot of that. What is that, a deer or a chipmunk? Chipmunk. I couldn't sign chip. off without getting a shot of that chip. That's what I thought it looks like, chip. How do you like that, boy? Huh? Is that fun? No. It's not? Oh, sorry. Do you like this park? Huh? It's fun. Is this park fun? This is a nice park for young kids. Surprised nobody's using it. Lots of big, huge trees for shade. It's real nice. In case you're wondering what we're doing here, Carol had to go change her rag, so I'm waiting for her to find a John and come back and pick us up. Got to keep that feminine hygiene freshness. Clean rags at all times. I know when she sees this, she'll be pissed that I said that, but I had to get it out. I tell them like it is. By golly, that was a giraffe that David was climbing up. And you know what? Carol wouldn't have had to go anywhere because there's a pot right here that would have been good enough for changing. Oh well, live and learn. Son, how does this place compare to Orr Park? Is this better than Orr Park or not? No. Huh? No. Is Orr Park still number one? Yep. You better believe it. Orr Park is still number one in your heart, right? Huh? Yep. You got on the merry-go-round too, huh, little boy? What's it? What is it then? It's a turnaround. What is it? It's a turnaround table. That's a merry-go-round. Merry-go-rounds have horses. Well, that's what they call them when they're at the park. Where's your mother? I bet you she had to take a dump too. We gotta get going. We don't have time for dumps, right, bud? Right. This is fun. What'd you say? This is fun. It's fun, huh? Well, I'm glad it is. That's why we stopped, so you could have some fun. Well, now we're back home from camp. It's about 6.30 in, at night, Sunday night. We're here at Shangri-La. Shangri-La. Yeah, as you can see, the flowers are just gorgeous. Carol's getting the bugs out of the pool so that GL can take a dip. Gotta have it just right for daddy. You got that right. Uh, let's go take a closer look at these flowers. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. There's the ferns. The uh, impatience are coming along real well. The rhododendrons got new, got a lot of new growth on it. We got the fountain there. Some more of the ferns. It's just looking real good back here, right? Right. You don't have to worry because I never shut up when the film is rolling, and the film is rolling right now. We're rolling. That's right. <laughs> I'm glad that I, I finally rated to get on one of to your get on videos, one of my Gary. tapes. Yeah, yeah, I've watched about nine hours of them now. Now you're going to be able nice you'll, to you'll be able to see yourself on the two. That's right. Stacy will be able to see herself. Stacy, say something. I say she's going to get you whether you realize it or not. Stacy, say Come something on. so you can hear what you really sound like. You Come won't on. believe it. Yeah, I will. Oh, well, you've heard yourself before. Stacy. Come on, you're a hand. Huh? You Have know. you heard yourself before? Stacy, when I'm all dolled up. I look worse than you do when your hair is all messed up, okay? So, be happy. Well, I'm sorry. Young. Well, come on. It's time. Don't you think it's time to hit the water? Yeah. yeah. 
Buck, you're ready, aren't you? I'm, I'm digesting a little right now. You're I digesting? Mean, yeah, I, I eat on the way. Hey, so. Bucky, hey what? For digesters. There's what? Bird, What'd you say, son? A bird took an itch in our pool. And he did. In the old pen? Yeah. Nice yeah. talk, huh? <laughs> Nice talk. Hey, Carrie, go ahead. Get in that water there, little girl. Get in that water. You ever talk that with your kids? No. I didn't get into it. Yours, buddy. Mine's worse than yours. Now, what's wrong? What's the problem there, little boy? Doesn't he want to go in the water? Cut it out. Oh, yeah, but you can't. But, but you've got to talk to me or do something. You can do anything you want to, lewd or otherwise. I'll turn my head. Go ahead. Go ahead. Do whatever no, we're not going to. Okay. Oh. I'm in line next. Wait, I can I can get that on on my uh, movies that I have on my VCR. Hey, Gary. What? Let's go upstairs. Huh? Nothing. Can we? Can we get that? I got is it. Is that on there? Oh, it's yeah. On there. All right. It's on there. That's You'll great. Be able to hey, that, that beats a still shot. Now i got to have a copy of and it, all, too. And all, the time, all that time there, he was uh, sucking his thumb. You're sucking face, and he's sucking thumb. <laughs> sucking face, and he's sucking thumb. And he's sucking thumb, right. Grouchy. And then here comes Carrie. She wants to get into the picture, too, don't you, little girl? Huh? Can I have a kiss first? Uh, Give mommy a big kiss. Oh, uh, hey, yeah. Gary, nice Gary, wet say, one. say hi to Gary. Hi. Turn bucket. Hi. How are you? How do you like that water? Yo. It's fine. It's not cold. It's not cold. Well, jump on in there. Oh. <laughs> well, my <laughs> Don't give me that famous look, bud. I'll Maybe pop your it? jaw. I've got a hamburger with your name on it. Do you want it? Come on up here, bud. Put some meat on your bones. This is it because this is supper. Put some meat on your bones, little boy. Look at Carrie in that water. What are you picking, girl? Huh? Digging for gold. Hey, David! Wave hi to Dad! Hi, Dad! How about I wish you were here? No? Forget it, Dad. He's too busy finding himself a playmate. Or a play puddle, whatever it happens to be. Playmate gone, time for the old puddle. Now, Ray, on the other hand, says, do do on the puddle when I have the ocean. And she's been checking, hasn't found any fox yet, but give her time, she will. David tried like crazy to get her to come sit in that stupid little puddle. And if I know David and his power of persuasion, he'll do it. a 12 year old make a fool of herself. Or will we? It's in the 90s right now and it's about 6 o'clock at night. The tide is out but it's coming in. We've already been in playing for about oh an hour or so. And if you're wondering why I didn't start filming right away, Gary, it's so humid. Everything was all steamed up and the dew light was on. So I said forget it until later. We're going to go out tonight by raft. Thank you, Daddy. And we're going to go out to eat, pick up some groceries, and probably can it pretty early tonight. Scoo is in taking a nap because she grew, drove all the way here. And where, you ask, is David? In the puddle, of course. We're going to have to go up close and get a look at this. Call this a pond with warm water. Let me see your great big ocean here. Is that right? Come on, put your feet in. All right, I will. I just wanted to make sure we got this great big pond here. Huge pond versus the whole Atlantic Ocean.
riding the waves. She 
just going to knock the hide off the ball so it comes back each time. Now I'm up. Everyone blink. All right. All right. Here I go. This is Mom. Look. Don't do that tilt tilting wait, anymore. Wait, wait, wait. Turn it, Renee. Turn it off. Stop. Right here. Not bad. Not a Carol Simpson shot, but David says I'm going to tap it. How much was that for him? That, Renee. that was just about six. Five. It was just five. I don't care. Five. Okay. Well, what Renee, David, get out of the way. I don't know. He shot the two. How many does Renee have? I don't know. We can play back the film and find out. Give her five. We'll be generous. We'll give her six. She missed it again. That little yeah. tiny putt. Choke. Okay, Scoo, let's see what you can do. Don't humiliate yourself. Renee, you just walked Two. in front of me. Sorry. Two. Not bad. Sorry, Mind you, only count as one and a half. It was on the left. Is that right? Huh? Should I only be one and a half? No, no. Rainbow Falls golfing. Come on, boots. You see that shark behind you? You see the shark, Renee? Yes! Seriously. And his name is Gary. Okay, Dad, here I go again. He's John's and Mommy. Okie dokie. Whoop. Bounce off the wall and... Oh, okay. Mm. Nah, didn't quite make it. I hear All right, turn it off. Oi, bye-bye. Okay, David, let's see what you can do. Knock the hide off of it and misses it. Good try. What happened, David? An easy two. An easy two? You're sure of that? Yeah. Okay. I didn't have the camera on, so I had to correct my error. Scoo just about had a hole in one on there. Right, go ahead. Nick it in. There you go. Good right, job. Right. All right, Renee. And Renee hits it. Now, we'll shoot. You're not even going to get close. That's two for David. Yeah, 
Yeah, you say young man. <laughs> you just missed a phenomenal putt on mom's part, dad. I flubbed the first one, went back to base, and I hit a hole in two, but it was just about like a hole in one. Because it was from the mat. All right, hole eight, let's go. And David has a little problem getting up the hill. He has no problem, he'll just smack it again. Too bad. Okay, come on, sweetie. <laughs> Air ball. Hit the ball, Renee. She smacked that sucker. It's gonna go back down, I'll bet you. She could be in trouble. Ah, she lucked out. David Boy just hit a pretty good shot. Although this is a pretty nice golf course, but they've got some really sorry geraniums. Now Scoo's gonna see what she can do. Now the kids are taking this for fun, but I think Scoo's out for blood. And Always. She, oh, and she she says she wants to beat me so badly. Of course she's also gonna choke on this. Let's see. <laughs> That's right. Nuzzle yourself in the corner there, kid. Oh, Good shit. job. Oh, shit. Good seven foot putt. Scoo's got a seven foot putt and she's dying to get it. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Scoo, I picked up another one on you. David just made another fine shot. Where are you, boy? Show us. Don't get on the course, though. Point to it. Good job. All right, Renee, let's see what you can do. Another fine shot by the Simpson family. And I had a hole in one. Yeah, and I got a four. Yeah, I got you a were hole tied. In one. You sure did. David, as always, cannot right wait. In. I got two. Dave, but they got a two also. David cannot wait for us, has to be ahead of everybody. But he knows that his ball will be taken away from him if he puts it down to play. So he's been I'm real. Not I'm not playing. Yet. He's been real good. All right, honey. This is hole number 14. Well, he got it off the, the putter surface on one. 